Anybody follow what happened to Florida's precious environment during this session? <laughs> David? <laughs> well, it was a good year for the, the Everglades. Um, okay. There's $70 million in the budget for Everglades cleanup. Um, that's something that uh, they've been working on for years. Uh, not only was there the money in the budget for that, um, but, but they reached uh, an agreement fairly early in the session uh, on how to do it. Uh, and an agreement that the next day was praised by uh, the Audubon, you know, Audubon of Florida and the sugar industry. So, uh, you know, they, they, they figured out a way to, to work out a compromise on how to do it. Um, I'm not an expert on all the details, but uh, I think there's a general consensus that it was a pretty good year, uh, certainly for the Everglades. Remarkably on that point, too, a lot of that funds a, a proposal that Governor Rick Scott, of all people, had proposed some months ago. And uh, Scott did not seem to uh, capitalize on the credit he maybe could have, uh, you know, credit himself with uh, in, in that. The, the amount of money that's going into Everglades restoration is, uh, is, is fairly significant. And uh, Scott, Scott is focused on his two uh, priorities. He's siloed uh, that way, it seems like.